Shashi Tharoor comes from a party. When he decided to contest the Congress nominee for the national president, Shashi Tharoor ji came to Tamil Nadu for campaigning. Please ask Shashi Tharoor, Shashi Tharoor ji, how many people came to receive him in Congress party office in Chennai? Two people. State party president escaped. All MLAs escaped. All MPs escaped. The press asked the other fellows, why you did not go and uh, see Shashi Tharoor? Because it's a, a mad, uh, in the top they said, both the person should be given an equal opportunity, be it Mallikarjuna Kargeji or Shashi Tharoorji, both will be treated very nicely. Then the Congress party people said, no, no, Gandhi family ji mein order agya. We cannot receive. He is only a namesake fellow. It is Mallikarjuna Kargeji, they have sent it. And if he receive, they will fire us also. Shashi Tharoorji ran to be the United Nations Secretary General. Manmohan Singh ji did not even seek votes for Shashi Tharoorji. Shashi Tharoorji also writes in an open magazine article that government of India did not support me properly. Shashi Tharoorji and myself, we had a debate in uh, Chennai, sir. He came for Tuklak debate. Both of us are supposed to sit here and Senator Gurumuthi ji will sit and we are supposed to debate and discuss some ideas. Unfortunately, my flight got delayed from Delhi and we agreed that Shashi ji will speak first. Then, after I come to the stage, if Shashiji is graciously sitting in the stage, I will speak in front of him. If I will reply to his uh, questions also. If not, I will speak. By the time I reached and climbed up the stage, Shashi Tharoorji said, long journey, tired, he has spoken for long and he wants rest and he left the stage. Then since it's a two-speaker event, I have to give my answers to him. Now, Shashi Tharoorji made a lot of arguments there. I'm sure the same argument holds for Kerala also. Here also you might say the same thing. The first argument he said, oh, you see, after BJP has come to power in 2014, all institutions have collapsed. All institutions have collapsed. There's nothing called judiciary. There's nothing called a free and fair democratic way of an arrest, everything. Now we have to understand, Shashi Tharoor comes from a party. When he decided to contest the Congress nominee for the national president, Shashi Tharoorji came to Tamil Nadu for campaigning. Please ask Shashi Tharoor, Shashi Tharoorji, how many people came to receive him in Congress party office in Chennai? Two people. State party president escaped. All MLAs escaped. All MPs escaped. Shashi Tharoorji was standing alone in the Tamil. I am telling you this sir, as a challenge. You ask Shashi Tharoorji who is talking about institution. Two people were in the state party office in Chennai when Shashi Tharoorji was campaigning for the national party president election. Then the press asked the other fellows, why you did not go and uh, see Shashi Tharoor? Because it's a, a mad, uh, in the top they said, both the person should be given an equal opportunity, be it Mallikarjuna Kargeji or Shashi Tharoorji, both will be treated very nicely. Then the Congress party people said, no, no, Gandhi family ji mein order agya. We cannot receive. He is only a namesake fellow. It is Mallikarjuna Kargeji. They have sent it. And if he receive, they will fire us also. Terribly embarrassed. Shashi Tharoorji returned back. Now he is talking about BJP as a party where all of us first generation people and many of your first generation, our fathers and mothers are simple farm people who are doing farming. We are standing in front of you. He wants to compare about BJP. Second. Shashi Tharoorji ran to be the United Nations Secretary General. Very interesting story. I, I actually want you to ask Shashi Tharoorji. He failed. He failed. Then, very beautifully, two, three books were written later uh, on, on the UN process that happened, which I gave in my Tuklak speech also that day. Later, Shashi Tharoorji also says, when Manmohan Singh Ji sits in a lunch, working lunch with the American US Secretary of State when the visit happened to India, Manmohan Singh Ji did not even seek votes for Shashi Tharoorji. The Americans of course wanted to support a Korean, Ban Ki-moon. He didn't even ask him, please support our candidature. There were many countries in the Middle East where the Indian ambassador did not even go and seek votes for Shashi Tharoor. That was the nature of Indian diplomacy. Which Shashi Tharoor ji also writes in an 
ஓபன் மேகசின் ஆர்டிக்கல் தட் கவர்மெண்ட் ஆஃப் இந்தியா டிட் நாட் சப்போர்ட் மீ ப்ராப்பர்லி ஐ ஐ வாஸ் டெல்லிங் இன் தட் டுக்லக் ஃபங்க்ஷன் இஃப் இட் இஸ் மோடிஜி எஸ் பிரைம் மினிஸ்டர் ஹண்ட்ரட் பர்சன்ட் வி வுட் ஹவ் மேட் சசி தரூர் அஸ் யூ அண்ட் செக்ரட்டரி ஜெனரல் இஃப் இஸ் குவாலிஃபைட் இனஃப் செகண்ட் பார்ட் இஸ் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் சார் இஃப் இஸ் குவாலிஃபைட் இனஃப் சின்ஸ் இவாஸ் ஆர் அஃபிஷியல் கேண்டிடேட் வேர் வாஸ் த காங்கிரஸ் பார்ட்டி வாட் ஃபாரின் பாலிசி இஸ் இ டாக்கிங் when when is when the own congress party when he was not a member when he was a diplomat suddenly becomes a member of congress party suddenly he says oh congress all great all super and fantastic the third one congress alone used 91 times article 356 madam indira gandhi used it 51 times he comes from that legacy modi ji in the last 10 years you please recall one instance sir where modi ji has used article 356 such a strong government 303 mp 17 states in power why modi ji did not use a single 356 he is taking as a lecture on democracy you used it 91 times madam indira gandhi alone used it 51 times and then sachi tharoor takes a le- lesson to us saying oh institutions have collapsed after modi ji has come what institution has collapsed sir what institution has collapsed suddenly they want to make electoral bond an issue sir 44% of electoral bond bjp received 56 percent electoral bond opposition party received then should we blame oh opposition parties you went and threatened it you got 56% we got only 44% what nonsense are they talking sir a ruling party for 10 years okay 2004 to 14 we'll we'll flip the argument when congress was in power how much corporate donation bjp received 70% congress in power bjp receiving 70% means sir you have your money in the packet sir you come to me you come to my friend and say jay shankar ji and say jay shankar ji i have 100 rupees in packet can i contribute to your party now jay shankar ji will say no 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 please go and give 30 rupees to communist party 40 rupees to congress party they are struggling poor people and 20 rupees to all regional party 10 rupees to me that is enough you show me one person who will say that sir a money will chase a place where they think that money is well utilized when bjp receives 44% of electoral bonds it simply means people trust it is not corporate simple person they want to buy a bond for 1000 rupee 2000 rupee they want to come and give when congress was in power for 10 years 2004 to 14 70% of corporate donation bjp received why because they believe this fellows have messed up everything bjp will come and right now we have to kill all this nonsense in the butt el troll bond they twisted this person there were some intelligent congress people pulwama attack after that somebody gave money to somebody some company in new delhi some company in karachi on congress sir you see this karachi fellows donating that is the level of brain sir people all of you i really feel for you because argument can be countered with an argument how will you con- uh, how will you contradict nonsense with an argument the last 10 years half of our job was only countering this congress nonsense so institutional collapse all this are bogus 